Back at Christmas time, I got a cool book. It's called uh, Behind the Lines. It's kind of a heavy book. It's a collection of war letters. And it's really cool because you read this war, you'll read a war letter, and the whole time you're reading it, you think you have an idea who this kid is. Maybe he's from Iowa or something. At the end of the letter, they tell you who wrote it. And it ended up being some, a Vietnamese kid writing back to, to his family or a, a German guy in World War I. And the thing is, is once you translate it and remove the identity, they're all the same. The sentiment's always the same. And it got me to thinking about this, especially Christmas time. There's the story of the Christmas truce where the World War, World War I guys came out of the trenches and played soccer and lit campfires and hung out for one night. Then they went back to killing each other the next day. I always think about Really weird stuff. So, this is a song I wrote called Dying Lines. <laughs> Mom, take good care of dad. Waiting for war letters. The 
just no way to pass the time for anyone that comes like your soldiers dying lines. Good drinking music.